Let's make a volleyball real quick. Don't remove the default cube this time. Go to edit mode by pressing tab, then right click, subdivide. Increase the number of cuts to 5 so we get enough geometry. Now make the cube round by pressing Alt plus Shift plus S and dragging your mouse outward. We only need the top part for now. Select the middle vertex, keep pressing the plus, plus, key to expand the selection, then select the whole top section. Press Ctrl plus I to invert the selection and delete the other vertices. Enable face select mode. Now select two lines of faces from the middle and press E to extrude them upward. It's a good idea to use a fixed value here so all panels have the same height. Repeat the same step for the remaining face strips. One side is done. Change the pivot point to 3D cursor. Duplicate the mesh and rotate it 180 degrees. Duplicate them again and rotate 90 degrees on X. Duplicate two panels and rotate them 90 degrees on Z. You'll notice two of the sides are facing the wrong direction for a proper volleyball pattern. Press L to select each side and rotate them 90 degrees on Y. Go back to object mode and add a subdivision surface modifier using Ctrl plus 1 or Ctrl plus 2. If you see gaps in the corners, that means we have some overlapping vertices. Go to edit mode, press A to select all, then press M, merge by distance. Now the volleyball mesh is ready. Let's add some color. Volleyballs come in different designs, I'm adding three materials for three colors. Select the faces for the first color, then press Ctrl plus plus, plus, to include the inner faces as well. 